Good morning, or afternoon, or evening, whatever it is, wherever you are, I hope it's good to you. I uh, got some packs over the weekend, as you can see, I won five uh, matches yesterday. We didn't win the total 15 matches for the last week, but another mysterious egg. An emergent ultimatum. Nothing new there. Go to the store and check out our dailies. Uh, Saturday the dailies were pretty good and I got them. Uh, we use the incubation. So we're going to grab that. And then we got a mastery point while we were at it. So let's see. Uh, it's probably going to put it here, right? So we'll see. Yep, that's exactly where it put it. Uh, how are we doing? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We're nine away from the frost cub. Oh, and we're quite a ways away from grabbing that sky cat cub. Well, we've got to win more and get more in order to get there, right? So, let's see what our deal is today 20 or 30 green or blue spells I used the flash of ferocity deck yesterday for the green blue spells let's see how it does uh, I lost I played three games with it and I lost all three games so the sea bass look we match Okay, Spectral Sailor, we need another land for Night Pack Ambusher, we need another island for Sinister Sabotage, but we'll keep what we have. Our opponent has the Umori, that's the choose a card type, which they might just say creature. There's our second say hello. That would be our second island so we can get the Sinister Sabotage out. Nice. Another Castle Vantress. Does us no good to attack with the Arboreal sitting there. Oh man, that kind of sucks. We're still in the same spot, no good to attack. How long before they're ticked off? Can't be too long, right? Oh, they had two of them. Oh, so his mutates cost less. Oh, man. And they get card draw out of it. Oh, I like that one. I'm going to save the Frilled Mystic for the next one. Like that one. Yeah, we'll Frilled Mystic that one. Oh, 
Oh, he threw away a Sea Dasher Octopus even. So we can opt and Wildborn Preserver. We had to draw it in order to play it. We need to keep, actually this turn will do it. We can play X. X is what, one, two, three, four, let's do five. Which means we don't have anything saved up to stop them. but I have a 7-7 seven, seven with reach. It's the first time in a while I've won with this deck. Oh, look at that. We get up to diamond. No, platinum. Gold, platinum, right. Diamonds after platinum. We never left platinum last month, right? So. All right, so we got 10 of the 30. Let's see if we can continue that streak. If we can get 10 per match, that would be great. Kazahara Khan. Wow, no blue there at all. Opponent goes first, so we're hoping to draw blue. We'll see. And who knows, we might. First first off the bat, right there. There we go. We're going to need another blue at some point, though. Oh. And it's going to double its 1 1 counters next turn. And yes, we will double block. And hope to draw a frickin' island. Huh, they saw we would double block, okay. 2-1-1 one, one counters. Damage equal to its power to target creature. A uh, creature card you own from outside of the graveyard. We're gonna tear you up. Wow, nothing. We can't play anything there. Ah, 
time to disappear into the brush. Eight counters. We can only survive one more hit. We really can't survive that. Again? Which way do they go this time? Beats in unison with the wild. Yeah, that doesn't help us. My Still need a land. How you've grown. You're gonna get 20 counters on it. Holy crap. I think we got what, three? Three spells down? Four. We got four. Woohoo! Um, let's go to the Artisan event and without actually looking at the decks, okay, neither of them are. I just wanted to see if either of them were green-blue decks. Because if they were, then we would play it. That deck. But I guess, you know, I'll just have to do the Artisan on my own. Sometimes I think the Artisan decks is cool. Like the token deck. Man, I like that token deck. Forest. Brazen Borrower. See, that would have been great last turn, right? Alright, so we get everything can come out. Eventually. Grind more with an Umori. Do they really only have two mana? Okay, they had more than two mana. Depends on what they put down. We can quench. Okay, I'd rather keep that.
I like the control deck cards that also allow you to put stuff on the board. We can quench. Both of these guys pump up. They don't have the two to pay. If Mori goes away, then they get the vampire out. Okay. We're going to put this out in case they attack with one of their flyers. We can put this out in case they try and drop something bigger than a Vampire of the Dire Moon, like a Tez Tessa. If all they would have done was attack, it would have been okay, but... Another cruel celebrant. As long as that stays on the board, though, we can't do anything. Good old Temple of Mystery to another Temple of Mystery. Right now it's one, two, four. Are they not going to attack? They're not going to attack. I don't know what's going on there, but... An unsummon. Nice. I could put that back in their hand and then attack. Um... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I can do a five. Make it so they have to spend five. They've got something in their hand, I'm sure. Alright, so one, two, and then we've got three, four, five, so we can do five. Those guys each pump up again. We get a Thornwood Falls for a life. And, you know, they can pay, although they could pay five. They couldn't pay ten. Twice. They'd had to pay twice. Gain a life. That has flash and reach. 
next to combat. Willing to take 15 damage. That's pretty good. Gain a life back. Yeah, that's a nice one. They sacrifice one of these to give that death touch and indestructible, so these two die. Yeah, no thanks. Um, so we'll take action and we'll give it, I need two green and two of something else. So we'll give it three. decline this time but we should start getting wolf tokens If we get another night pack ambusher, that would be good. Good game. And we might have actually made our goal. We made our goal. Got a corset, got an Ikora. What do we get in the corset? There's some that we haven't gotten from the corset, so we could still end up with new ones here. Uh, not this time but we could I said Ikora look that's a new one Mythos of Vadrock five damage divided as you choose among any number of target creatures and or plane walkers if a plane and a island was spent to cast a spell until your next turn those permanents can't attack or block and their activated abilities can't be activated that's actually a pretty cool card cool all right so we've got about seven minutes let's try one of the decks um, I guess we'll start with yard work <laughs> yard work okay and our opponent is drafter man We have an evolving wild and a forest. Wow. Wow. Okay. Yeah, for those of you who know me, you know I don't like the fabled passages and evolving wilds and stuff like that. I mean, they're good for what they're designed to do, but... I don't like them because you have to actually sacrifice them. And you know, why have that many lands in your deck if you're just going to end up sacrificing them? And I have more than one? Holy crap.
And it comes in tapped. Well, that's not nice. We can gain a life. Angelic gift, so it flies. Oh, we have reach, but it doesn't mean anything. Wow, wow, holy crap. So we've got a lot of escape cards, which I guess is good. Excuse me. <coughs> the more we put into our graveyard, the better we have. <coughs> a chance of pulling stuff out, so... Like this one can come out this time. And it's got reach. So another evolving wild. And we'll do, I guess, a forest. We'll do a forest. And then we'll do the... This. And we'll take that out. And we'll take that out. And I guess that and that. Because this one has escape on it. So now we've got a 4-5, and let's see. Oh, nice card. Holy cow. I can take one of them, maybe. Do I have any land in my graveyard? I don't. Alright, so that looks like it might be the end of today. Uh, for those of you who joining us from YouTube, I hope you guys have a great day. My name is In Harm's Way. 
If you are not a subscriber, please consider subscribing. If you are a subscriber, hit the notification bell. I put out videos five days a week. We'll talk to you guys next time. Bye-bye.